All right, we are here at the inaugural. Is that how you say that? 2023 Just Paddles Paddle Draft with three paddle experts from Just Paddles. I'm pretty pumped on this one, mostly because I got the number one pick randomly. Wasn't me. Uh huh. Wasn't me. And you saw it. Uh huh. The person who picked it was actually there. So you uh-huh. know it wasn't rigged. It wasn't me. <laughs> so the rules are pretty simple. It is not a snake draft. This is not this is not a fantasy football team. There's no snaking happening other than if I snake or you snake the paddles that I'm looking at. We're each going to pick our top five paddles. There's no uh, nothing off the table. The only rule is you can't double up. So if I pick paddle A, it's gone. It's gone. So you can get a different you can get the paddle in a different width, right? You can but but nothing. Oh, okay. uh, so yeah. So if I pick one of a paddle and it comes in a fourteen or a sixteen, you can take the other um, oh. paddle with option. But that's the only rule. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. Game on. So, with the first pick of the twenty twenty three just paddles paddle draft, man, I wasn't expecting the first pick. I'm gonna pick the Diadem Edge eighteen K. Oh man! I gotta be straight up. I wow. was gonna, I was gonna try to take that like round four or no, five, thinking yeah. nobody else would go there because it's not a lot of potential. A lot of potential. Great paddle, though. Good. Pick. That is a. I I think that is a strong choice at number one. However, this is not the NBA draft where there's a clear favorite. I think we're gonna all end up with great teams. Yours, unfortunately, just won't be as great. Right. Right. <laughs> but we'll see. That's going to be a lot, uh, a lot of start, a lot of starting uh, years to come. That paddle. So, Kyle, you are next with the second pick. With the second pick of the twenty twenty three just paddles paddle draft, I will pick the uh, the carbon one x sixteen millimeter. That's clean. I, had, I did not think you were going. The, that uh, <laughs> that's been my paddle for the last probably five or six months. Pwned it in. I think we'll see, but love the power. Love what I can do at the net with it. So. I'm going with that. That's my baby. So I'm um, happy to have uh, the Carbon 1X 16 millimeter on my squad. So the route I'm going to go at pick one, three, I don't think this paddle's coming back to me. So I'm taking it now. Ow. The Selkirk Invicta Power Air. Whoa. Let's start off with some pop to start this thing yeah i love that was a sick move because that was going to be my next paddle and that's that my it's in the background too there i know i was gonna grab (laughs) it he did that to you that hurts that hurts bad (laughs) overall strategy was planned and that that definitely hurts i literally have to go back to my list and see where i adjust because it's not just one adjustment i'm gonna have to make several now that you did that so are you gonna have to trade back now to me hey, I, trade I'll, back I'll, you need more time on the clock i'll give you a 2024 20, second round no there's no <laughs> <laughs> you could have six paddles next year ben yeah that's huge <laughs> who's, who's losing to that lineup golly that hurt thank you jason i can't believe that just happened i didn't think you were a huge fan of that paddle i was that was that was my primo paddle there for for quite a few months yes. when it first came out. Okay, well, I'm going to go uh, just to, you know you're, what you're going to get out of it, and uh, it's not going to be a surprise, so I'm not going to shock anyone. I'm going to go with my second pick, 2023 Just Paddles Paddle Draft. I'm going to pick the Yola Perseus 16 millimeter via Ben not Johns. A That's a good pick. Classic pick. It's hard not to go with it's, that. It's one of those paddles that everybody who picks it up likes it and can play with it. It's an awesome pick can't go wrong with the perseus 16 yeah you know honestly getting that in the second round kind yeah, of a steal. steal kind of a steal it it's a fan i think it's a fantastic paddle and it, and it could have easily gone first round that's the that's the best part of this game is like i said it's not the nba draft or the nfl draft but there's a clear favorite there's like 60 first rounders on here so we're all gonna have like nasty teams oh, yeah oh yeah oh yeah kyle all right you're up that leaves it to me huh Woo. all right well uh i've hit yoles in the past love them but i'm gonna go with kind of a dark horse here really good paddle really good power paddle i'm gonna go with the pro kinnix black ace pro so um probably the second hardest hitting paddle on the market second probably to the diadem vice in my um opinion but so uh, most powerful usap approved correct yes you'll go with that um (laughs) yeah 
like kind of like the carbon you can hone in a lot of power but if you can hone in the drop stings reset super thin and yep. sounds a lot like jason's <clears throat> power air yep so i i just saw jason go for the uh the, uh the, the power air the thin paddle so I, I i had to get one on my roster so there you go well i didn't expect this to fall to me um but I wasn't, I, I'm going to have to take him. I'm going to have to take the Yola Ben Johns Hyperion CFS 16. Nice. That's where I got to go. Old school. That. Also a classic, just a, I mean, ha, literally everybody who picks that thing up likes it. Yep. Oh yeah. And it, and like, even though the Perseus is out and the Perseus is yep. an incredible paddle, this Hyperion still, still everywhere, still a force in the market. Everywhere. Absolutely. All right. My third pick is going to, it might surprise you, it might not. However, this is, this, I said in a video that it was my favorite one shot paddle, and that was a fact. And it was, and it will be probably for a long time. I absolutely love the way this played, and because it was, it, I thought it felt like it um, filled all the holes in my game, right? I'm looking for certain things out of my game. And this one kind of filled the gaps out of my game. So I'm going one shot arrow infinity shot Ooh. as my third pick. It's a great choice. I love it. Honestly, love it. exceptional choice. It's a, it's a underrated pick for sure. Cause that, that that's a filthy paddle. Yeah. Kyle, are you going black, black or white? Which, which color? Well, <laughs> that's not part of the rules, Kyle. It's the paddle. So I'm going to put both that's of them fair. in my bag and laugh all the way <laughs> to the courts, Kyle. <laughs> all right. So my third paddle, I'm going to go with the uh, uh, Bolair Mach oh. 1 16 millimeter Forza. Golly. The Forza. I, I've played with it. For a few sessions and i'm loving how it is uh performing so that is I a am phenomenal going, choice yeah, yeah they've volaire's done a lot of cool things so I, i'm on the ammo it's also packaged very nicely it comes with a paddle eraser a grip and a little uh band too um really great they knocked the presentation out of the park so absolutely another i mean all these could have been but another strong potential first rounder yep so with my pick at three three, I have to go with what I've probably been playing with the most recently. I have to go with the Electrum Model E Elite. Dang, that cool. thing, the blue edge guard pops, but this paddle, great blend of power, good enough touch. Like very pleased with how the E Elite came out of yeah. Electrum. It's definitely a difference between that and the original one. A lot more power with the E. So uh very happy with that one too. Yeah, great pick. Well, again, I was not expecting this to fall to where it was. I'm thrilled to take it, and I'm sure one of you would, would have taken this. This is going to um, match, in my opinion, Kyle's and Jason's power, most powerful paddles. I need something in the, in the hopper to bring the heat in case it's a windy day or I'm playing someone who doesn't handle power as well. With my fourth pick, 2023 Just Paddles Paddle Draft, I am picking the Gearbox CX fourteen E Ultimate. Oh, see a lot of those paddles out there playing. Yeah, is su yeah. super clean, real thin, ton of power, but it's also that one. It's that one piece you can you can sling it across the court if for whatever reason you lose, and you know when you pick it up, it's gonna be just fine. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, oh yeah, Jinx. <laughs> Yeah. All right. So fourth pick, um, I am going to go with the Engage Pursuit MX 6.0. Great choice. Classic. A lot of power to a lot of control. My game, I'm more of an all around player. I like to think I'm an all around player. So I love a little of both. And that provides me with a little of both. So a big fan of that uh, Engage paddle. There. I got to be honest. That's where I was going to go next. Wow. So, wow. Wow. Steal my minute, so. Yeah, you're on. So I'll. No, I'm good. I, I oh, he's got he's got, I a got lot my of alternative <laughs> set up and ready to go. We just keep shuffling the list up as we need to. So with my round four pick, pick four three overall, I am taking the Diadem Warrior 
version two. Oh, that bad boy is so slick. Yeah, the 19 millimeter core. I get phenomenal touch with that thing. The edgeless design. The sweet spot seems endless on that thing. Can't go wrong with the Warrior. That is a good choice, and I like your your versatility in your draft order because now your, your your team is kind of built out. That is like the ultimate touch paddle, right? That thing is like, and and oh, by man. the way, nineteen millimeters, but it's a little bit heavier too, so it's still you still bring the juice, but like the stability of that thing, the touch of that thing is is probably second to none. Oh yeah, oh yeah, very happy with that being my fourth round pick. Yeah. That's that's a that's a good value there. That's what the kids call it now. I think. <laughs> also, a potential first rounder. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, I cannot believe that this has this has made its way to me. However, I couldn't be more thrilled to take it, Kyle. I think that this paddle is better than your number one pick. Oh wow. All right. And it's coming in as my fifth. I think I know where you're coming from here. Here we go. With my final pick to round out my team, I'm going to go with the Carbon 1 16 millimeter, the original one. Oh, the, the OG, OG, baby. I think Ooh. was our best selling paddle, maybe still is of all time. Uh, brings as much power as anything, but it's also got the stability, it's got the touch, it's re- and it's got yep. the crazy spin. So I think. Uh, I, I've pulled a rabbit out of a hat with a fifth pick. Yeah. Wow. I, I Bravo. agree. That's a, that's a solid, solid pick. Yep. My gosh. Wow. I'm in between two paddles right now. It's oh going to be, well, you're on the clock. One can make the, this cut. Ju- the, 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 the clock on the just paddles paddle draft is short. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think I've got a decision. With my last pick. I'm going to kind of go with one that it's a shape that I don't usually play with, but I was very pleasantly surprised with it. I'm going to go with the Yola Scorpius 14 millimeter and a bright signature paddle for my fifth pick. That- so I've got a little variety with all my paddles a little bit. So um, I was actually very surprised with how, you know, the square paddle, a lot of idea usually I'm not used to. And I was a lot of power, a lot of touch again, what I'm looking for, but. 14 i'm usually not used to but uh very impressed so and that that shape i i have hit that paddle as well that's one of those shapes that you probably wouldn't hit if you know out of the gate you wouldn't choose it and then when you did you're like dang i really missed out (laughs) i would have really missed out if if i didn't try this because that paddle is legit yeah and it's never it doesn't hurt to have anna bright in your corner so that's right she's on my team yeah that's a good point (laughs) She's as fierce and and talented as anybody. I love her energy. It's all good. All right, Jason, no pressure. Rounding it out with the 15th overall pick. The final pick. With pick Mr. Irrelevant, if you will. Um, Brock (laughs) Purdy, anybody. Um, But I am going to take the paddle that I won, the Kansas City WPT tournament. 4.0, to be exact. Um, Yes, World Pickleball Tour. I am taking the Gearbox GBX, Ooh, their yeah. first high-end um, poly core paddle. That thing is legit, hit it excellent. Of the park with that. And you know, if I want a tournament with it, I have to put it in my in my 100%. team. Percent, yeah. And that that to me is like the it's like the uh, Hyperion that you had picked or the Pursuit that you had picked, Kyle. Like that. That's yep. just like the classic. If you're an overall yep. like all around player. Boom, put the yes. GBX in your hand, you're ready to go. Yep. Got that great blend of touch and power, yep. which I All think for ben- that. which benefits a lot of people for sure. Well, how do we think it went? I, I I mean, I know we all think we have the best teams. The best part is we're gonna let the people decide. So we're gonna have a vote on which team wins, which team is the best team. Then we're gonna have Uh, We're going to give away each one of the paddles on on our team. So whichever team wins the most votes on who has the best team paddles, we're going to give away all five of those paddles. So it's going to be kind of wild. So we'll see once and for all who did pick the best team. And I'm a little nervous about it because you both have solid crews. You already know Team Kyle, baby. Vote, vote Team Jason all the way. If you vote Team Ben, we might give away two. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, no, not fair. No. Come on now. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but we'll. Uh, I, I'm pretty excited to see how these stack up. Nicely done, gentlemen. Your teams are Hall of Famers each. Uh, and oh yeah, we'll see you for the the second paddle draft whenever that happens. I'll be ready. Deal. Deal.